Thank you much, Amanda. Well, taking a family trip for a vacation or holiday weekend is not unusual, but for one Northeast Mississippi family, their summer vacation was not only unique, but potentially life-changing. The entire family spent nearly a month in a country in Western Asia. Every Sunday, Trey and Courtney Wildman lead the college and career class at Tupelo's West Jackson Street Baptist Church. They also have two children, nine-year-old Mac and six-year-old Clara Francis. Dad! When they're not at church or taking their kids to various activities, they're busy like any other family. Trey helps run his family's building supply company, and Courtney is an elementary school teacher. Earlier this year, Trey went to Nepal on a mission trip and stopped in Jordan on his way back. He met with a pastor and other missionaries and learned of some needs his family could help out with. There was lots of talk while we were there about needs for uh, people to come over there and teach English, and it's better for, for English-speaking people to teach uh, uh, mostly the Syrian refugees in English. So I thought, what a great opportunity for us to come over as a family. This summer, the Wildman spent three and a half weeks in Jordan, where they worked with Christian missionaries, helped lead sports and ballet camps, and taught English. Trey says he knew his kids would adapt well to the long trip and the new culture. They're very resilient. They, they've always gone with the flow. They don't typically complain. They typically are, are, are down with it no matter where the ride leads. So they were excited. I think Claire France was a little bit nervous about getting on the plane. It was my first time on the plane, so I like felt kind of sick before the plane. Clara Francis enjoyed her first plane ride, and once the Wildmans got to Jordan, they stayed busy and experienced the hospitality from another culture. They value relationships is one thing I would say about Jordanians. We were there to, um, to serve them, but I ended up feeling like more often than not they were serving us. We were invited into homes of these refugee families that had nothing, and I can't think of one home we went to where they didn't bend over backwards to make us feel comfortable. Holy Spirit. Clara Francis was baptized by her dad in the Jordan River. Mom, dad, brother, and sister are ready for a return trip. I'm the one who wants to go back a lot. I miss the missionary kids, um, and I just liked it. And by the way, nine-year-old Mac tells us he also learned he can share his faith wherever he is, whether it's at his school or halfway around the world.